Hello and welcome to the Real Estate Minute. I'm your host, Ivan Estrada, with Ivan Estrada Properties at Douglas Solomon. And in this episode, I'm giving you three ways on how to make your home more energy efficient from construction to completion. So the Real Estate Minute is gonna work like this. There are three segments. One minute each, three minutes total. Let the Real Estate Minute begin. No need for AC or heat if your home is made with this material. ICF, which stands for Insulated Concrete Form, is the new way of building homes with less carbon footprint. It's made with foam and plastic, and right in between goes in the concrete. Not only is this less carbon footprint on the planet, but it's more energy efficient. Or if you're in areas such as Maine, Alaska, or Minnesota, it'll keep the hot air in during those cold winters. Now, yes, it does cost a little bit more, three to $5 a foot, but you'll be saving so much more on your electric bill. And also at the end of the day, it makes the home a lot stronger because it's made of concrete. When installing solar, it's crucial to answer this question. Installing solar is a great way of reducing the carbon footprint on the planet. Now, a couple of pros is carbon footprint, less throughout the planet. It reduces the cost of your electricity. Now, some of the cons is, yes, it's a little bit more expensive for installation. And two, depending on the area that you live in, it might not work out best for you, especially if it's a very shady area or if your roof is a bit pitched. Now, there's a break-even point. That break-even point is when do these solar panels actually pay for themselves? If it's 10 years and you're only going to live in the house for let's say three to five, then it probably doesn't make any sense. This is something that you wanna discuss with your solar panel professional to make sure that this investment is worthwhile for many, many years to come. These two sensors will improve your quality of life and give you peace of mind. Acara has come up with a new sensor that uses radar to make sure that your lights turn on and off when you're in and inside a room. Now the old way of doing it is it just uses motion. So let's say you're reading a book, you sit down and you're completely still, lights turn off. But with Acara, this will not happen. Now, Yolink is another really cool sensor. Now, Yolink can be placed underneath your sink, near a water heater, or underneath any of your pipes under the house, and this will detect any leaks. You will get an alert on your cell phone to make sure that you are aware that you're wasting water, and also to call a plumber to fix it immediately so that it doesn't become a much bigger problem. Thank you so much for watching this month's Real Estate Minute on three ways of how you can make your home more energy efficient. I'm Ivan Estrada with Ivan Estrada Properties at Douglas Elliman. Don't forget to follow me on social media and I'll see you next month.